All right, so we're back with some more basic skipping tricks. So this time we're gonna do a few different ones. We're gonna look at front and back, side to side, and then combining those two into a bit of a triangle, okay? So always, and remember, we want to be doing our turn and then jump. So if we're struggling with the turn and jump, make sure you go back to my first two lessons to get your jumping and your turning right first before you try these tricks. So, for a normal one, we're just going over with our double jump, but we want to go forwards and back, forwards and back, and then we can start doing it as a single, forward and back. Alright, let's just show that from a side on angle as well. So I'm going to do this jump now. It might be good for you to practice just the jump before you start. So we're going one, two. Kind of like how we practiced our jumping at the start. Okay, but we're going to go forwards and back. One, two, one, two. One, two, two. And then we can start doing it as a single. All right, so the next one is we're going to go side to side. So again, we can practice this without the rope. One, two. One, two. And you can get see I'm going side to side on where the line is. So I start off with my double. One, two, two, two. And then I can start adding it as a single, okay? So that's my side to side. Now, what we're going to try and do is we're going to try and go like in a triangle. So I'm going to do one, two. So you can see I'm going forward and side diagonally this time. So we can start with the double again. One, two, one, two, two. And then we can start going in a triangle a little bit. I lost my way a little bit. We might try that again. So start off with the double. And we're going sort of in this triangular shape on the ground. Obviously a double is easier. So that's our triangle with a double. And then we can start, ah, if I get my rope right, doing that. A single, okay? It's a bit tricky to tr get that triangle. You can also try having maybe some dots on the ground, or you can mark in chalk where you need to jump to, and that might help with your direction on that triangle trick. All right, that was my second instalment of skipping tricks okay um wait until i have another third version and i might even do a fourth version i'm trying to upskill myself and learn these as i go because some of them i haven't done before either so it's really cool that we're learning together